it's a camera boy Jonah and Natasha and the Sony A7C and today we're gonna check out if the A7C is a very good camera for photos. Let's go! <laughs> the first lens that we're gonna try is the 35mm 1.4 beast lens. I really like the small little islands in the back and then here this plan to give some foreground element is gonna look awesome with the 35mm. Yeah, I really like the 35mm depth of field with the 1.4 here, that's why this bush is really nice as a frame. I'll show you a little video of it. And what I also asked the model to do is, Natasha, go a little bit back, is to have some fun while she is coming. I'm ready, Natasha, go. And uh, you can have fun. <laughs> The sun started blasting in the background and this is my first negative with this camera. It only shoots at a maximum shutter speed of 1 over 4000, which made me not be able to shoot at 1.4. And if you buy a beautiful 1.4 lens, that's what you want to shoot most of the time. Now I had to shoot at 2.8 to have a right, correct exposure. Oh, we found this beautiful cactus here and Natasha is in orange. Make that the outfit stands out in the environment, so this orange versus this green here from the cactus is really really awesome. Settings are 1 over 4000 and 2.8. Maybe a little bit more in the cactus. Quick little photo tip here. Obviously you sometimes as a photographer have to watch your own shadow. As you can see we don't want this on Natasha. My favorite thing about this camera though is how small and compact it is and when you put the cheap, budget-friendly, nifty 50, 50mm 1.8 lens on it, it's super light. Even Natasha can hold it. <laughs> <laughs> so let's take some more photos with this camera. Currently it's a little bit too bright outside so we found this small little cute cafe here and we're shooting under this roof. This makes for a nice soft light on the model. And in the background you have all these nice orange lights which will give for a very very nice bokeh. The nice thing about a 50mm lens is that you can really choose your composition. For example, this is not so beautiful, but the cafe is very beautiful and it's planned as well. I can be a little bit more tight and really choose myself what I want to have in the frame and what I want to leave out. Another quick great tip is, and especially for people who are not real models, sorry Natasha, <laughs> maybe if you take pictures of your friends for example, give them something to do, something natural. For example, Natasha loves coffee, she's a small coffee addict. That's why she now has a coffee to pose with and that makes it easier for her to actually have a natural pose and not focus so much on being photographed. So we saw this nice little frame here, so Natasha will take a seat. It's gonna be like a feeling of her sitting at the bar and me just taking a photo from outside. So we're using this here as a foreground element because with the 50 it's always nice to have something to give some blur and depth and then we have a yacht in the background that's pretty lucky so you can be fancy little woman Natasha with your yacht in the background Ooh, Natasha. that looks pretty awesome to do kayaking here guys next time you will find us shooting POV style on a kayak deal now you got some new glasses here from a brand that we're shooting for give me your best shot baby <laughs> I have no idea. So Natasha wanted to have a try <laughs> no, I don't want to at try. shooting Dario? <laughs> to, be Dario. Honest, to be honest, she said she's better at giving styling advice. So this is why <laughs> she will be taking the pictures from now on. I'm Let's gonna, try yeah, I'm gonna watch. Let's try. The UV style, guys. Check your t-shirt, your blouse. This the reason why we did this as a first shot was we have the nice uh, blue in the background. A simple yeah, shot yeah. to show off the glasses. It doesn't need to be too crazy. Not too distracting because we want the product to be shown in the photo. A great tip of Natasha, style the model. That's as important as the framing, everything else. Style the model. If you are a beginner photographer and you're wondering if the Sony a 7 c is something for you, Natasha is now shooting with it. If she can take good pictures with it, I'm sure you can too. Look at me and uh, hold the sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> too much, too much. Yes. <laughs> Let's take some backlit shots now because that is also one of the things where I feel like the A7C is a little bit subpar to the A7S3 for example that I'm shooting with right now. So let's get some backlit shots. Natasha switched her outfit so let's take a backlit shot and see how this camera still performs. For Dario we will shoot a little bit more the orange background. That really matches his yellow glasses an orange outfit, so we will go for the rocks as the background more. <laughs> <laughs> gonna, take now, <laughs> gonna take a photo now of the male model and the female model. I always personally like to have the male look away, so Dario you can look away. And Natasha you can look straight into the camera. It gives off for a little bit more of a manly pose when Dario looking away and Natasha seducing the camera. And it helps Dario 
a bit with the posing as well now that he's up against the real model now some backlit shots of the duo see how it looks now see how it looks now shooting some backlit video then you guys can see a little bit the capability of this camera video wise This is also a big big tip, something I so many times forget myself. Don't always take photos standing up. For example, now we're gonna take some shots of Natasha sitting down, laying down some different poses than just standing and walking. We will take some last shots now with the sun lighting up Natasha. And we have this nice orange glow in the back. So we have the color of the water, the orange glow, and then Natasha, really nice color-wise. Oh, it's good to have a lot of variations of the pose. If you want to see some more photos of this awesome lens that's only $200, well then check out my video that I shot here. I actually give a lot of tips in that one. 